It was the biggest debate in world football. Ronaldo versus Messi. Rather, there were two debates. Can Messi do a Maradona? In 1986, the prince of football, the magician of football, had led Argentina to a World Cup win. On course, he scored perhaps the greatest goal of the century. He demolished England and decimated Belgium. Can Messi do an encore? Leo Messi started the World Cup rather bad. A loss and all of Argentina felt it wasn't to be. But then God's child had something else written for him. In the next match, down Argentina needed Messi to strike and then came out that magical left foot. A brilliant strike and Argentina was alive. Thereafter, it was all Leo Messi. The greatest football fans of the world took over Qatar. We were all there and we were completely taken by what we saw. The Argentina fans were there to conquer and to celebrate the greatest footballer of all time. One step at a time, Leo Messi marched towards immortality. He had Angel Di Maria, he had Alvarez, he had all of his compatriots backing him up. And then comes that magical final. Argentina two up. And all of a sudden, from the 70th minute onwards, it was France. Kylian Mbappe had something else in mind. Incredible final. And just when the world thought that it was France, Dibu Martinez, Emiliano Martinez, just stretched his foot in a manner that nobody could have envisaged. Leo Messi was alive. Argentina was alive. The million fans of Argentina and Messi were alive and had a new lifeline and a new song to sing. Thereafter, it was Messi's World Cup, Argentina's World Cup. Once and for all, the debate was settled. There is no greater than Leo Messi. And yes, Messi did do a Maradona. Exactly a year earlier, we celebrated Leo and we continue to celebrate him. Take a look.